Hello everyone. You are watching English Grammar with Neelam Sasani and we are doing kinds of sentences. In my last video, I had told you about assertive sentences. Okay? Today we are going to do second type that is interrogative sentences. Okay? So let's start. Before that, if you have not subscribed my channel, please subscribe so that you can get the notification of my next video. So let's start. Today we are going to do interrogative sentences. Okay. Now, kinds of sentences in that today we are doing uh, second type that is interrogative sentences. Now let's take some examples. Where are you going? This is the first example I have taken. Where are you going? Now in this sentence, this sentence is doing what? It is asking us something. It is asking a question. You see the second one. Who is standing there? Here also in this sentence something is asked. Okay. So the sentences which ask questions. Okay. The sentences which ask questions are called as interrogative sentences. Okay. So let's write sentences that ask questions. So sentences that ask questions are called as interrogative sentences. In the above sentences we have seen where are you going and who is standing there. Okay. Now Secondly, these sentences, they end in question mark. They end in question mark. Assertive sentences, in the last video we have seen, there the sentences end in full stop. So, assertive or declarative sentences, they end in full stop, whereas interrogative sentences, they end in question marks. Okay? Now, so, sentences that ask questions are called interrogative sentences. They always end in question mark. Now, let's see the types of interrogative sentences. Now, interrogative sentences are of two types. Okay. First, WH type. First is WH type and second starting with helping verb. Starting with helping verbs. So interrogative sentences are of two types. First WH type of questions and second the questions starting with helping verbs. Now let's see first one WH type. Okay. Let's take some examples so that you will understand. So the first type we are doing that is WH WH type of questions. Let's do some examples. First one. Where are you going? Second. What is your name? Then third. Who is sitting in the car? Fourth one. How are you? Arrive. 
and last one why are you laughing now here we are doing wh type of questions in that we have taken some examples just see the first one where are you going okay second one what is your name third who is sitting in the car fourth how are you fifth when will the train arrive sixth why are you laughing now just see look at all these questions they are all beginning with wh word they are beginning with wh word where what who when why now look here the fourth one it is beginning with how it is not beginning with wh but still though it is beginning with h how it is coming under wh type of question okay so all these sentences beginning with wh word they are called as wh type of questions clear okay so the first time in interrogative sentences we saw wh type of questions now let's see the second type the second type the second type begins with helping verb okay so beginning with or starting with starting with helping verbs now these questions starting with helping verbs are of two types either they are affirmative means positive or they are negative okay so the questions starting with helping verbs either they are affirmative or they are negative now let's see some examples of affirmative and some examples of negative first let's do some examples of affirmative let's see some example like can i have some biscuits question mark can i have some biscuit okay then was it very cold was it very cold third one is it a long drive okay so can i have some biscuits was it very cold and is it a long drive now you see these questions are beginning with helping verbs they are called as helping verbs and now why do you call them as affirmative in the last video i told you when there are no negative words in the sentence we say the sentence is affirmative or positive so in the same way the questions these questions they do not have any negative word okay so they are called as affirmative questions okay so these three sentences they do not have any negative words like no not never nothing neither no so they are called as affirmative questions okay now let's see some examples of negative questions negative questions as the name suggests negative means having negative words in it okay so first example 
isn't this food hot question mark isn't this food hot second one don't we all know you third one wasn't it raining yesterday wasn't it raining yesterday okay and the last one the fourth one we'll do it couldn't you couldn't you inform me okay can you see the last sentence couldn't you inform me so these four questions just look at them they are all having negative word not they are all having negative word not in them so all these four sentences they are called as negative questions as these questions they have negative word present in them okay so they are all negative questions got it okay so some homework for you all to do i will be giving you some sentences what you have to do is you have to pick out wh type of questions from those sentences okay so few examples few sentences i'll be giving you you have to pick out wh type of questions okay so a uh, small homework for you to do it first sentence what have you done what have you done second sentence how are you how are you feeling today then third sentence did you get the answer fourth one which book which book do you follow and the last sentence were you present for the meeting question mark so look here these five sentences i have given you all what you have to do is you have to find out whether the sentences are wh type okay so whichever sentence you find it is wh type you have to uh, write it separately and in front you have to write it is wh type okay so uh, today we have done interrogative sentences i hope you have understood it if you have any doubts any queries you can uh, ask me in the comment so today we'll revise in short we have done interrogative sentences the sentences which ask questions are called as interrogative sentences now interrogative sentences are of two types first wh type and second beginning with helping words so wh type begins with wh type of words and the questions beginning with helping verb they are of two types affirmative 
having no negative word and negative having negative words present in them okay and all these sentences they end in question marks okay so any doubts you can ask in the next video we are going to see the next type that is imperative sentences so like my video subscribe my channel see you in the next video till then have a nice day goodbye